You understand me? So that's what I did. And shock the hustler, and I'm a hustler, so everybody understands it. Ain't no one man gonna stay in one spot forever. That's a sucker. I'm a hustler. I'm gonna come up. So I took what little bitty gave me and doubled up and doubled up and doubled up, and I've been doubling since. And I'm gonna keep on doubling till these niggas kill me, and that's that. Can I get a blunt, please? <laughs> yeah. Word. Yeah. My records, I swear to God, I will. Yeah, I'm gonna have man. Record so cool. They selling and everything. My shit popping up. Shit's yeah. starting to be cool, but I mean, that don't mean nothing. Because, goddamn. I done seen a, 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 I done seen eviction notices before, and they ain't pretty. And it don't say if you rapping on trip. <laughs> don't say that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> the motherfuckers be like, yo, what they say? They say, uh, get your ass up out my chassis if you ain't got my rent. And my rent, I'm gonna tell y'all, it's fourteen hundred a month. And that don't include the motherfuckers that got to clean it up. It don't include gas. It don't include none of that shit. It don't include my very large chronic habit. It don't include none of that. But I pays it, man. I bust it. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. That's why I be tripping. Y'all be sitting in the paper be like, what's wrong with that? That's why I be tripping on niggas when they try to flex on me, you understand? Because I'm out here hustling. Just like any nigga on the corner out there slanging, going through the risk he got to take to slang whatever he got to slang, I'm out here slanging. And all this risk that niggas try to make me go through, I'm going to make them feel the fire like I got to feel the fire. And that's real. And anybody can't understand that, they don't understand the black thing. It's going to stay black. I'm not going to act white just because y'all want me to act white, just because all these other motherfuckers act white when they get their papers. I'm going to act very black. I'm going to buy bins because that's what niggas do. Uh -huh. You understand me? I'm going to smoke weed because that's what niggas do. Uh -huh. I'm going to pack a gap because that's what niggas do. You understand me? I'm going to get drunk because that's, that's what niggas mean. do. You understand me? I'm not going to change just because motherfuckers got money. God damn, I'm going to go through my hardships just like the next man. I'm 21 years old and God help me make another day. But I'm, I'm going to go through it my way. I'm not going to act all enlightened. I'm not going to act like I got this Bible that tells me I don't got shit, never had a dad. I had to teach my motherfucking self how to be a man. You understand me? And I'm still learning. But it can't a motherfucker out there tell me shit. Because I was on welfare, started with nothing. Now I got a little bit of something. I'm on the bright screen. I'm on videos. God damn it. That's why I act like this. You feel me? That's why I act like this. Because my mama was a crack addict, man. I came up from out of nothing. Much love. I've been getting more and more pussy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 He all. We know he all. He did the dope shit, Janet Jackson. Hell yeah, I had my tongue in her mouth. It was all that. <laughs> <laughs> I, was playing, I was playing a young nigga. That's the only character I could play. I know motherfuckers gonna get tired of seeing me in the movies because I'm gonna have the same part every time. That's <laughs> gonna be a young nigga. Hell yeah. I'm gonna be a I'm gonna juice. I was a young nigga with a gun. And this is a young nigga with a baby. And the next one, I'm gonna be a young motherfucking nigga. God damn it. I'm gonna stay playing young niggas until so I'm old this motherfucking Dizzy Gillespie. Then I'm gonna play old niggas, god damn it. I'm gonna be an old nigga with a gun. I'm gonna be an old nigga with a baby. And I'm gonna be an old motherfucking nigga. I'm gonna stay doing movies as long as they stay paying me for it, god damn it. I'm gonna Whoa. stay rapping as long as they stay paying me for it, god damn it. And we'll what? Like what? We're with y'all singers. And we're gonna stay all good. good. And we're gonna stay low. I'm gonna roll with y'all I'm gonna show y'all motherfuckers how you really roll the motherfucking blood. Do it, baby. God damn it. Cause motherfuckers be swearing they be smoking weed, but they ain't smoking like I'm smoking, guys. Feel me? You can crack your sack off. Let me scoot over. I ain't gonna fuck that. I ain't gonna fuck that.
Oh, oh, real up? Oh, the source, yeah. But that's my nigga's cool. I'll take the rap nigga, don't you? <laughs> all right. It's all good, nigga. And I'm here on the riots and clown, nigga. On the 29th, your boy Pac was filming a movie, a melty million dollar movie with Janet Jackson. But that was. Well, get this guy, shit up. I was out there shooting up motherfucking Chinese takeouts. I swear I was. Psych! Psych! Hey, but bust it. That was a movie yeah. I was doing. Yeah. That was all the movie. Yeah. And Charlie was coming so. out called April 29th. Turn it down, boy. Prosecute you. Oh, come on, though. Yeah. Time for a motherfucking solo. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what happened, y'all. We did this movie called April 29th, and I just was shooting up Chinese takeouts in the movie. And I got a part in the movie. <laughs> All right, on this new Off the track. track. Gucci with you and MC Green. You know, what was up with all that? How'd you guys? Come on, man. Y'all go way back? Me and Green, yeah. I was on my way to get my third line tattoo that you see in the video. And his manager was outside the tattoo spot. I said, Bree, down here. I said, Where? He said, Yeah, I said, Well, where? I went to where he was at. He was in the studio. I laid my shit. And the shit is the first single off his album. So it's all good. Tupac and MC Bree. Oh, I did it in Detroit. Huh? Yeah, with Five Dollar Denim. Yeah, with Trip. What's up with that? I knew how it was going to come out because we wasn't all in the studio at the same time. I remember I was doing my vocals. Trex walked in, pulled out a pistol, said it's his turn. He did his rap. He left, I left, I had to get this shit, everybody made it, five daily friends, it was all good, it shows niggas can't come together and do their thing. Yeah, it is, you're too tough, 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 you're too Let's do it, dude. Ask me about the Yeezy rights. Yeah, give me some. Oh, yeah. Hey, wait, 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 wait. wait. Hey, give me some. Nah, you had no chance, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was supposed to be a minister to society. Right, I yeah. went and everything and got the deal because of your boy. You know, they, they yeah. was my niggas that used to do all these videos for me. They yeah. was the niggas that was talking that you should help your black brother shit, and I helped they punk ass. You know what I'm saying? It was helping them all the way. They got a little movie deal, tried to act white on me. You understand me? And thought I was gonna choose a career before I choose my motherfucking principles, my manhood. So I said, okay, cool. Fire me from this hundred thousand dollar movie. Because I ain't gonna play no gangbanger who's a Muslim. There ain't no such thing. I refuse to play parts that don't exist. I will be a young nigga, but I will be a real young nigga. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna, that's gonna make me different than all these niggas that's taking parts. And if it's about the money, I might as well stay a drug dealer. You know what I'm saying? It ain't like that. So fuck you, Hughes brothers, for doing that. Then I leave, they fire me over the air on TV, on MTV. They say Tupac fired for threatening the director. What really happened, let me tell the world. He said, I said, you acting like a bitch. He said, you acting like a bitch. I said, well, goddamn, if I'm a bitch, smack a bitch. You feel me? He said, well, if I'm a bitch, smack a bitch. And I stepped towards him. You feel me? But he a bitch. That's real. And I ain't. That's real. Feel me? So the nigga fired me. They did their little million dollar movie. I ain't sweating the whole while they was filming the movie, even though I was in L.A. the whole time. Didn't touch it. Because I ain't want nobody to think it was because of the movie, and I'm not jealous. Y'all handle y'all business. I can understand that, and I can respect that, no matter how much funk we got. You a nigga doing your business, you do it. As soon as the movie was wrapped, though, it's all good. And I met the motherfuckers at the Spice One video for Trigger Got No Heart, and the short Spice One was singing how the Trigger Had No Heart. Tupac has no heart. What's that say? Heartless. And I beat the motherfuckers down. I threatened. I said, both y'all niggas got the car. We about to box. His brother, his twin brother, got out and started running. That's on my mama. He ran. Fling. Twins. He ran. Fling. The other brother got out, started talking shit. He walked away. I socked his punk ass and started throwing things like I'm born in the box. The partner he had with him started begging me to stop beating him up, but I kept beating his punk ass up. Then, instead of fighting me like a G, he ran. Now, I can't help it if some niggas that was on the scene beat his ass for running. That was something separate, you understand <laughs> me? And I can't help it if they were screaming thug like as they did. That ain't my fault. That's just how shit went down, you understand me? But now niggas need to start living what they preaching. They want to make gangster movies. They better live a gangster life. That's real. Or make movies about what the fuck they know about. But it's, I got to have these nightmares. These motherfuckers really put me in jail. They really suing me. So I'm going to really live this lifestyle. And I'm going to make other motherfuckers really live this lifestyle. Because it can't be crowded up here if motherfuckers ain't really putting their work. And that's real. Word.
What's up with that club scene in LA, dude? They shutting you down. What's up with that? Like, oh, I just I had a show booked for uh Jamaica House, Jamaica House right? Yeah. And they wouldn't let me in the show and my niggas, cause all my motherfucking whatever you wanna call it, fans of the niggas that buy my records, my homies. They the motherfuckers that say, well, if Pac can't get in, we ain't getting in, nobody getting in, and then closed it down. They had to bring police and riot gear. Cause you cannot ever underestimate niggas. We way too motherfucking strong. Like that. Hey, Jack, can you get a witness? What's up with uh Pee Wee? Twin brother gives we really don't know. He just went murder. Yeah. Pee Wee. People say he your twin. Uh, you know, yeah, just, break that shit up, man. my nigga, man. I just told y'all I don't have no family. Pee Wee my nigga, he's my homie. He's been my homie through this drug and ground. He's a dope ass rapper, dope producer. That's all I'm listening to. Yeah. Okay. Now, another one. Run it, eh? Close this shit up. Don't ask me. Don't get a deal that y'all ready to be, man. Hey, they got me, cash. They got me. Yeah, yeah, show me my shit. It's weak. Ask me something real. My shit is. Hey. Hold on, P. Hey, homie, tell us what that open life was about, dude. How long have you been in Oakland? We know you came via Baltimore. I came via New York, Baltimore to Oakland. I was there about two years. So we hear that all in the albums, you know, how you get so much feeling from Oakland. Yeah. That's where I got the game at, you know what I'm saying? Coming out of New York, I always learned about flavor and different shit like that. Not to diss New York, I learned a lot, but I never knew the game. I never learned the game. And when I went to Baltimore, I didn't learn the game. Nobody ever took the time to show me the game. When I got to Oakland, that's when I learned the game. That's Who peeped you up on that? Shock G or what? No, nah, nigga, the game. It's not even one person. The <laughs> yeah, game no. is just in. The game is just like in me. It was in me. Somebody just awoke it. Somebody just woke, woke it up inside me. You know what I'm saying? Like they're like a religion. And I just saw it. And I saw it in Oakland. I saw it living in Oakland. I saw it thriving in Oakland. I just saw everybody being about the game. That's the first time I saw all niggas thinking about one thing, the game. And they all followed one rule, the game, the rules of the game. Yeah, and that's, that was never in no other city I lived in, so I give all my love to Oakland. If I'm a claim somewhere, I'm a claim Oakland. Even if I don't live there, I live in LA now, but I'm still claim Oakland. That's where the game began. Right. So I, I'm, 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 I'm a resident, you know what I'm saying? So what do you feel Oakland needs? Like in the 60s, they came up with the Panthers, who was strong from strong to Oakland and made noise. What's going to make noise with that? Oh, nice. they, got, they got the players. They got Section 8. They got Rich Rich. They got the governor. They got Too Short. They got E4, they got the clip, they got the, the Bay Area is moving something. You know what I'm saying? Don't get it twisted. It's like they got a whole little revolution of music that's coming out. Niggas that's rapping from their heart. They not taking nobody else's style. They just doing it. Is that strong enough though? Yeah, that's, that's all it takes, nigga. Don't you know? Yeah, that's all it takes for a motherfucker to be original. And that's where everybody be biting from. You know what I'm saying? That's what gave me the game, I just told you. So everything I do, you can give it to others. Give all my, my Grammys and shit to Oakland. What's up with your boy that get all the props out of Oakland, Hammer? What's up with that shit? I, I, don't, I don't know who that I is. I speak in on that. Go ahead. Let us know how regular this shit really is, homie. You know yeah. what? Yeah. I grew up with the motherfucker, man. He ain't gave nothing back to East Oakland, the ghetto of East Oakland, it's down yeah. in the hard spots. He bought the cops a chopper, though. He ain't from Oakland. No. No, uh, he ain't gave nothing to the town. He ain't did nothing for East Oakland. But he don't even mm. come through the motherfucker. Because he ain't from there. No, he ain't from there. Hey, where you from? Triple? I right. think he's from um, Oak Town. Oak Town, I don't know where the fuck Oak Town is at. <laughs> I've been born and raised. I moved to Oakland in 71. I, I don't know where the fuck Oak Town is at. I ain't ever, you been to Oak Town before? <laughs> you swinging that Oak Town shit on a major level. I've never been to Oak Town. Yeah, yeah. Oakland. Yeah, Oakland. And I, now, Oak Town is a place where you can jump off Taco Bells and shit and float <laughs> and, <laughs> and all that other shit. But Oakland? Yeah, Oakland is just gang city, though. It's bars, alcohols. Yeah. Bitch, big, we got you out of that call. You know. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Yeah. We want to go to this area. Yeah. It's all good. What we'll made you move to LA? Because I had to leave all the money. And, bunk. and niggas could eat up so small, somebody could just go in my house, you know what I'm saying? And tie just, everybody up. Tie everybody up and be having a piss in my mouth before I knew it. Shit. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't I couldn't even find out who did it because it's so small. 
and it's so tight, you know what I'm saying? The game is so deep, you won't even know who beat you. And when, when I live at right now, they can come get me, but they got to have a bulletproof heart. Because <laughs> it's all good, and I can see them coming. And we all even, you know what I'm saying? It's big enough to where we all even. But I'm open, everybody knew where Tupac lived. I had motherfuckers coming to my door. Oh, 40, do, 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 do. Yeah, Tupac here. Yeah. You live on the strip. I live on the strip. strip. You, you know what I'm saying? On the strip. What strip is that? The strip. The black hair. The black hair. Everything on there. Everything. Oh, we just shake our hands. I live there, man. At a certain time. I used to come out to LA and do shows. Niggas breaking in my house. Stealing my AK. Yeah, yeah. Selling head jobs. Where's oh, okay. I'm the toss them up king. I'm <laughs> Come on, head jobs. Niggas that got hella head jobs in my house. Hell a bitch that I was provided through my, you know what I'm saying? Just hella head jobs, jobs, man. You, you know. Can you let everybody know who your stepfather is? No. Like that. I don't believe in that stuff. Hey, that's some shit. You don't love this guy. That's some shit. <laughs> that's some shit that you know. That's some shit that is made He's up my very body. cold piece they of work. There ain't no such thing as a stepfather. My father is dead. He in the ground. Yeah. He's a hustler. You know what I'm saying? My sister's father is, you know what I'm saying, a political prisoner. He in jail for doing his thing. You know what I'm saying? And he's going to be in there for a long time. But now he's still giving me the game for free. You know what I'm saying? Handle my business on the streets. And my godfather, you know what I'm saying, is in jail for the same old righteous Panther shit. But now, that don't mean nothing. That should only tell you that it's in my blood. That shouldn't tell you nothing else besides that. Because every man got to stand on his own two feet, and that's what I'm about. Because my daddy ain't do nothing but give me the motherfucking chromosomes to be here. You know, and that's, he can't get no more other crap. All this came from the hoods. Hoods. They call me a goddamn cow. Hey man, fuck you, man. He I'm pretty sure I'm sitting. Let's get down there, man. Oh, you on, homie? We got a ride for you. Fuck the cab. I'm finna go. We got a ride for you, homie. And I'm finna go lay up. <laughs> and if, if he had that option, his ass would have been gone when Blue got him. Lights off, shut that. Shut that. I'll be doing my thing. Yeah. Hey, hey, before you cut, Richard, do you want to cut this a little freestyle? Yeah, just on the quick tip. It's on the verbal cue. It's on the verbal cue. Yeah, just give us a little like free child flow. Like, yo, this is Spot Richie Rich. We introduced the check the verbal cues, G. Flow, flow a little something. Like that. The verbal cues, that's what I'm saying. The verbal cues, homie. Huh? Let's just do whatever you want to do, whatever you want to do. Pass the verbal cues. <laughs> <That's the verbal laughs> <cue. laughs> no, you you know, you start us off, Rich. I'm on it right now. I'm not going to come back. Come back. You don't need no music, man. You don't need no music, man. No music, no music. If I do G, you be paying me a free song. Nah. 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 He ain't never forgive me. He still had me to this day. I taught that boy how to throw a ball. He broke two main windows. I ain't fuck with that kid no more. We out of this motherfucker one what? time on the verbal cues with the news. Giving all of the moves and hopefully making enough money to get some new shoes. Where? Sideways. <laughs> yeah. Hey, yeah. I'm just going to go call me a goddamn cab. I got a bad one up here. Yeah, I'm there. On the quickness. Hey, yeah, just I'm right here. This kid yeah. over This is your nigga pop. Love some fat cock about to rock this rhyme for my niggas and black watching. Um, it's all good living in the hood and I'm on peak game and it's understood. They want me to bust a freestyle, but I gotta get paid, so. Show us a motherfucker, gotta get laid, ho. I gotta do my thing like I do it, and um, I'm through, cause you shit already knew it. <laughs> oh, boy. And next time if I get paid, I do something funky. <laughs> All that freestyle got to be free. Posse up. I'm black watch. Posse up. We thugging, thugging y'all to the 90s. Peace to my nigga K. Yeah. There we go. Peace. 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 Yeah, you know it. Once again, it's the Underground Mix coming at you. My name is Shock G. And I'm too motherfucking Pac. Yeah, okay. Now, see, D-Flow continues. 
D flow ain't stopped with no motherfucking sons of the P, okay? Hell no. Nah. We're gonna keep rolling. Just like we got two apocalypse, we got all kinds of things going on. Pac, why don't you tell these brothers what's happening? Stay See, tuned. let me tell you. First of all, raw fusion is no illusion. Gold money ain't nothing funny. They still humping now. We out of Oakland. My man Humpty Hump and the whole Digital Underground Posse finna come out with yet another album, even more slamming than the last. We just finna go straight underground. We finna live up to the name, Digital Underground. Tupacalypse come out with a new album, Troublesome. We finna just hit y'all like a family. We all just, you know, trying to make it. Thank you. Because it's all about the music. It ain't about all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? That other shit. All that other shit. It ain't about, about that. he and she and he and that and Fuck radio that. and spladio and dadio. It ain't all that. about that. It's about keeping the groove in the music yep. so that it relates to our people. Yep. And you know, can't nobody do that better than my man Pac. See, and my nigga Shock motherfucking G. Thank you, God. Hear me? Thank you, God. Shit. Yeah, so right, at, right about now, we want y'all to keep it tuned right here. And stay tuned underground with the underground mix. mix. Straight yeah. underground. Okay. Where else can a nigga yeah. pull right up to the camera and just be like, fuck all y'all? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Where else can a nigga tell a secret yeah, like, dole yo do, but yo, you didn't hear that right here. Yeah. Underground okay. mix. Come here. Chief Gates. On the underground I'm after mix. your ass, nigga. Yeah, once again, this is my man Tupac and Shock G on the underground, underground mix. Underground, y'all. Yeah. We out, man. We finna go. Yeah, because we... Yo, check it out, chill. Yo, bust the reggae shit. Yo, check it out. Drink it, drink it. Damn it.